You're watching Golden Gate Adventures with Michael Baltazar. In this episode, he's exploring the Excelsior. Hi, I'm Michael Baltazar, and you're watching Golden Gate Adventures, the show that highlights San Francisco's urban outdoors. Today, we're in the Excelsior District, and we're going to do something I've never done before. Pickleball. Let's play pickleball! Pickleball is an incredibly popular hybrid sport that is growing nationwide. Pickleball combines aspects of tennis, badminton, and ping pong. It's played on a badminton size court with paddles and a plastic ball, similar to a wiffle ball. Starting out is very easy. You can pick up a couple paddles and some balls for about 20 bucks, and the game is suitable for players young and old and all skill levels as you can see here. The game is played by two or four players. The ball must be served diagonally, and there are a couple other rules of play that are very easy to pick up. <laughs> the game ends when a player or team reaches a set score, typically 11 or 21 points, and you have to win by two. Pickleball courts are available across the city. Some are free on a first come, first served basis, but others require booking and a fee. Information about the courts can be found at sfrecpark.org slash 1584 slash pickleball if you're interested in playing. Wow, now I know exactly why people are playing pickleball all across the country. It's so much fun. You can play all different ages, all different skill levels, and you can just hop on a court and you're ready to go. It's a lot of fun. I'm glad I did it for the first time. All right, guys, let's go hit a trail. Time for a hike. there's a ton of hiking in the Excelsior. At 312 acres, McLaren is the second largest park in San Francisco. There are roughly seven miles of trails, including the lovely Philosopher's Way, that spread over forests and fields and provide fantastic hillside views of the city. And there's a meditative, quiet place at the top of a steep hill in McLaren Park where you'll find a spiral labyrinth made of rocks and city detrius, lost toys and found objects. Now we're at Glen Eagles Golf Course. We're gonna try out some disc golf. Wish me luck. And now, disc golf! Oh, 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 oh. So disc golf is similar to traditional golf, but played with flying discs. Originating in the 60s and 70s, Steady Ed Hedrick is credited as the sports pioneer establishing the Professional Disc Golf Association and creating the first standardized disc golf target, the Disc Pole Hole. The game involves throwing the disc from designated tee areas toward the metal baskets, which are the equivalent of golf holes. Players use different discs tailored for long distances, the driver, moderate throws, mid-range discs, and the precise shots, putters. Players begin at the tee area throw their discs towards the target basket and then proceed down the fairway. The player with the lowest total number of throws at the end of the course wins the game. Disc golf at the Glen Eagles course near McLaren Park costs $14 if you pay at the clubhouse. But there's an 18-hole course in Golden Gate Park that's free and tee times aren't required. Did you see that shot? <laughs> I won. Well, actually, I wasn't very good but now I have a huge respect for disc golf players all across the country. It's so difficult, but it's a lot of fun. Thank you for joining me in the Excelsior District. I'm Michael Baltazar. This is Golden Gate Adventures. We'll be back with another episode shortly.